Hello, welcome to LeadMaster. In this video, I'm going to show you what a lead nurturing track looks like and how to add contacts to a lead nurturing track. To begin, click on Campaigns. Then you can either click on the Lead Nurturing tab or select Lead Nurturing Track List from the menu. I'm going to close the calendar so we can focus on this page. This is a list of all of the available lead nurturing tracks. It shows you the name, the status, and you can edit, delete, or copy a track by clicking Save As and giving it a new name. If you have a large number of tracks, you can search for the one you want by clicking in the search box next to track name, entering a letter or two, and clicking Go. You can also jump to an individual track by clicking on the first letter of the track. In addition to editing, deleting, and saving your tracks, you can also create new lead nurturing tracks, add contacts to an existing lead nurturing track, import a lead nurturing track, and report on your lead nurturing tracks. Let's examine an existing lead nurturing track by clicking Edit. This shows me the track name, the track status, and who has access to this track? I can review the track steps and I can edit or delete any of the individual tracks. I can also add an email step or add a callback. Each step of the track has a number that represents the order that these are executed in. Each step has a name. Days after represents the number of days after the previous step that that step is executed. Since this is the first step, zero means that this email will go out the same day that a contact is added to this track. The next email will go out five days later, the next email five days later, and 11 days after you add someone to this track, you will have a callback added to your calendar. You can edit or delete each individual step. Clicking Edit opens up the email editor. This will be covered in more detail in another video. Let's return to the Lead Nurturing Track list. Now that I've shown you what Lead Nurturing Tracks are, I'm going to show you how to add contacts to a Lead Nurturing Track. Go to the Lead Nurturing Options menu and select Add Contacts to a Lead Nurturing Track. There are only two steps in this process. The first is to decide who we would like to send this to. Clicking Select Contacts opens the search window. Enter your criteria and select Go. You can have more than one criteria and you can delete the criteria. Once you're satisfied with your search criteria, you can select the Lead Nurturing Track. Decide the date that you'd like to start the lead nurturing and click Submit. You get confirmation that those contacts have been added to that lead nurturing track. This concludes the video on lead nurturing. 